first, I'm used to working on the scale, but nothing public, nothing outdoor. I am a mixed media installation artist. I do a lot of a large scale, room scale, site specific work, a little bit of everything, clay, plaster, uh, metal. I do a lot of bronze. This was Steve, Steve Dubov's brainchild. I was a partner in the studio, in Atelier 3D studio with him and Terry Wallman. And so we decided to go ahead and pursue it, to start looking for sites, um, start writing grants. Well, we're sitting around and talking about the public art places in Austin. What you can see and what's there and what's available. That was the inspiration, that we wanted to create something for Austin that used local and regional artists to install public art that, that gave people something else to see when they were going around Austin. I started to think about what would be eye-catching, what would be child-friendly, what would be outdoor-friendly, uh, what would be colorful, maybe have some movement in it. Um, so I found these, these are actually, they're acrylic wind spinners. They're all, they're industrial made acrylic wind spinners. We have 2,000 of them and they're on a steel infrastructure with uh, thousands of, of clips and springs and swivels and uh, all kind of moving in unison and, and making a nice chime and, and reflecting the sunlight. And, and we are hoping to donate this project to uh, some facility that works with children. And that was really important for me to do because I remember um, one of the things about during the chronic illness all the time that I spent in hospital what visual art there was, was really meaningful to me. When, when you're in that situation, how much something beautiful is transformational. It means so much to you in that time. And so I, I was hoping to be able to create something that children could enjoy, children in, in difficult situations. So that definitely went into to the conception of the project. It inspires conversations about art. As Art on the Way develops and gets so that we're, instead of doing one piece and two pieces, we have four pieces and six pieces, then you can have like a little map and you can go around and make a, t a tour, a walking tour, a biking tour, a driving tour, and see these pieces. And, and take away the intimidation, you know, say that, you know, you actually can be a part of this and you can be heard and, and your opinion matters to us. And, and we're hoping at some point in the future to be able to have various proposals that people can vote on and choose what art they want to see where. And so just bring the community in that much more that they become the curators to this citywide museum. That's a, a big part of, of what we hope will come next for Art on the Way.